Um, temperatures today are going to be climbing into the 70s, so it's going to be feeling more like late summer here as opposed to the fall season where we had the low cloud cover yesterday. didn't really break apart for sunshine, and it's not going to be, it's going to be a huge difference today. The clouds give way to sun. We're in the 60s right now this morning, 50s north and west of Boston. Dew point still okay. We're in the upper 50s in Boston, so the air is still comfortable, but it jumps up to our south and west. So we will see an increase in humidity today. You're going to notice the difference. The next couple of days here with the humidity coming back. Same view as yesterday, showers far north of New England and the Midwest. We don't have to worry about these, so we should be dry today. And what's going to happen here is the morning fog, which is a little bit uh, persistent north and west of Boston right now, will burn off. So too will the clouds and give way to more and more sunshine, but it takes some time, so patience here. In fact, through late morning, most of us will be mainly cloudy. Then from lunchtime onward, that's when we'll see some breaks of sunshine emerge and turning partly sunny through the remainder of the day. 75 to 80, high temperatures for many of us today. Low 70s on the Cape, gusty southwest breeze. We may gust occasionally over 20 miles per hour this afternoon. Low clouds and fog will fill back in tonight. Kind of a mild, muggy, uncomfortable night for sleeping. Temperatures in the upper 60s tonight. Tomorrow we go 80 plus. Humid too. 82 in Boston, 83 in Norwood, 70s along the south coast to Cape Cod. Meanwhile, Hurricane Michael, 90 mile per hour winds right now. Category 1 storm gaining organization and will continue to strengthen over the next 24 hours. Likely to become a major hurricane in the Gulf as it makes its way towards the Florida panhandle, making landfall with pretty de uh, big destruction in terms of surge, in terms of flooding rains, in terms of damaging wind, and then sailing south and east of Nantucket as of the latest update here, uh, Nantucket is out of the cone of uncertainty. So for us here at home, we will have some impacts, but they'll be kind of on the fringes of Michael as some of the tropical moisture gets worked in. So what that means for us is Thursday will feature a period of showers, turning to a steadier rain with some downpours Thursday evening and night. That's as a cold front comes in, and that's what helps sweep Michael out to sea may linger into early Friday in terms of some rain out over the southeast part of the state to Cape Cod. Rough seas and surf, and there may be some gusty wind on Cape Cod too uh, as the cold front comes in, but nothing too substantial here in terms of damaging wind or anything like that as it looks right now. Behind it, cooler, drier weather takes hold for the upcoming weekend. Temperatures back to feeling more like fall after being in the low 70s on Thursday with showers to downpours. Michael passes southeast in Nantucket early on Friday. Temperatures cool off upper 50s with sunshine. Looks beautiful on Saturday, around 60 on Sunday, and some showers return later for the start of next week.